life is not always as sweet and comfortable as we would wish it to be. Life is unfair. The world is unfair. Life is a mystery. You don't know what will happen tomorrow. You don't know what will happen today. Life is something we can't even tell what it's going to bring. We only hope and believe that things are going to be okay. We only hope and believe that we are going to be fine. Life can sometimes throw punches at you. There will be those times that you will suffer in this life. You will go through so much pain that you will wish to quit. I know some of you are going through so much pain now. Some of you are going through depression. No one understands you because life itself is unfair. You are going through sickness. You are going through luck. You can't even afford food. No one understands you. Life itself is unfair. No one understands your situation because of this life. No one can tell what will happen tomorrow. We keep going and having hope. The only thing that we can do is have hope. When you go to bed, have hope. When you wake up, have hope. That is the only thing you can do when life starts punching you, when life starts throwing bad things at you. When you start going through a lot of pains, the only thing you have is hope. And I know you are having a lot of whys in your head. Your positive thinking has been occupied by the whys, a lot of questions. Why me? Why this? Why now? What did I do? Why? 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 Why has God allowed this? I know you are going through it all. I don't blame you for those questions. The situation itself is not fair. People around you are not fair. Life itself, it's not fair. But you know, when you sleep and wake up in the morning, just know that God still have a reason for you in this world. Just know that you still have a purpose in this world. When you sleep and wake up, it means you still have something to accomplish in this world. When you sleep and wake up, it means you are still valuable. You shouldn't give up. You shouldn't give up. Have hope. Every morning when you wake up and see the sun, see the lights again, hear people speak again, you can still drink water even if you don't have food. You can still walk. You still have some energy to speak. People can still hear your voice. Just know you are still important. And God has a reason. You still have something to accomplish in this world. You still have something, a business, and done business that is waiting for you to do. And one day, one day, just one day, if you keep that hope in you alive and you keep trying, one day you will be that person that will overcome depression. You will be that person that will overcome divorce. You will be that person that will overcome failures. You will be that person that will overcome temptations of this life. You will be that person that will overcome. You only need to hold on that hope. Even if you lose everything, don't lose hope. Keep on hoping. Keep on hoping. Reminding yourself, oh, I have woken up again today. I have seen a new day. So I'm still important. Remind yourself every time. Even when people show you you are not important, you are not relevant, just tell yourself, but I have woken up again. I'm still breathing. It means I am still important and I can still do something and become someone important and become relevant in society. Don't give up. Don't listen to them. They don't matter. Their voices don't matter. Their voices don't determine who you are. Their voices don't determine your tomorrow. Their voices is useless. 
As long as their voices are there to break you down, their voices are there to discourage you, their voices only comes when you, they, they come to make you shed tears. Ignore those voices. They are not relevant. They are useless. Think positively. Think ahead. The mistakes you've done, the mistakes you've made, shouldn't make you despise yourself and feel you are worthless. No, you are still worthy. And that's why you're still breathing. You are not dead. You can only become useless when you die or when you decide to be useless. Don't decide to be useless and you are still living. Decide to be useful. Decide and get out of where you are. Start thinking positively. Remove the questions. Why, why, why? Remove them. Throw them away and start thinking, how am I going to get out of this? Don't think, why me? No. Enough of the questions. Enough of why me? Why, why? No. Now is the time you start Question of how I'm go am I going to make it? How am I going to make a difference? How am I going to get out of this situation? Think positively. Think positively. Life is not fair, yes. People around you are not fair. The world itself is not fair to you. The pains you've gone through is too much, I know. You faced the sufferings, I know. But those sufferings, can make you great and become someone. The overcomer of all disappointments, the overcomer of all bad things. You know what? Think positively. Remember to subscribe. Thank you for watching.